A new form of water treatment comes down the pipe for area citizens. The Water Pollution Control Facility held a ribbon cutting ceremony on Thursday, July 24th for its new ultraviolet disinfection system. Facility environmental engineer Chris Evans says this new disinfection process gets rid of pathogens and microorganisms in wastewater. It uses ultraviolet radiation or basically UV bulbs, kind of like you'd find in a suntan bed, um, to kill off any of those organisms and it brings it down to a safe level so that when it gets out into the river, it shouldn't cause any problems. As a first for the facility, Evans says the staff chose and designed this new system. The UV system was safest for our employees. It was the, um, fairly energy efficient and it just provided um, protection for the community. It's a step to ensure um, that the river is safe for people who use it for fishing, for swimming, for canoeing, for our kids that play in it. It's just um, taking that extra step to protect uh, the community and the environment. The river Evans references is the Skunk River, where treated water is sent. And now with disinfection, it actually, if a community needed it, they could probably drink the water coming out of our facility. In fact, I probably would drink this water as opposed to river water. Water pollution control is unique from the Ames Water Treatment Plant, which sends water to your house. The Water and Pollution Control Facility takes that water from your drains, treats it, cleans it up, and puts it back into the environment so that it can be used downstream for animals, for um, other facilities, maybe Des Moines, or um, other communities that may take their water from the river. It's just us returning that water back to the environment. To learn more about water pollution control services, visit www.cityofames.org slash WPC or call 515-232-7423 for more information. And keep watching Ames Channel 12, your key to the city.